Hey everybody, it's Mr. Regner here, and you know how we're preparing for our Ohio State tests in math, and I was thinking to myself, how can we help you make this test a little bit easier? And you know how sometimes you might have like a, a cheat sheet to help you out on tests? Well, luckily for you, the Ohio State test in math comes with its very own cheat sheet. It's actually what the state calls a reference sheet, and I wanted to share that with you right now. So let's check it out. Here it is. This is the Ohio State Test reference sheet. Now I want to caution you for a moment here, because although you get to use this reference sheet, you may go through the entire test and not really even need it. There may not be any questions that require this information, but it's nice to know that you've got it. And I want to make sure that you know that this is information that you don't need to memorize, you don't need to have like uh, locked into your brain because it'll be on this reference sheet. So taking a look at it, it's the same sheet that you get in seventh grade. So as sixth graders, we'll have the same thing next year. But basically some of the information that we um, maybe have memorized or have worked on throughout our year will be on this reference sheet. So for example, how many feet are in a mile or yards in a mile? How many pounds in an ounce or how many ounces in a pound? Right, and then you think about like our big G, you know, quarts to gallons, pints to quarts, all of those measurement conversions are there for us on this reference sheet. And then down at the bottom, this is our metric conversions. So we talked about King Henry doesn't usually drink chocolate milk. Well, there we go. All of our metric conversions are there for us. Now, the nice thing is about King Henry, we know that we can convert really any metric uh, measurement by just moving our decimals to the left or to the right. And some of you really like that method, and I would still recommend using it for our test. But just in case you forget, uh, they're giving you kind of the equivalent numbers here. So kilometers to meters, meters to centimeters, centimeters to millimeters, right? If we understand that information alone, we can do these conversions. But with King Henry, it might be easiest just to move our decimals around as you convert. So once again, this is our sixth grade Ohio State test reference sheet. Uh, so we'll, we'll make sure that we're aware of it now. And on test day, you'll receive this. It'll be a piece of paper passed out to you that you can use during your test. I hope it's helpful.